हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज तनुजा गुप्ता वेलकम टू माय चैनल एंड माय न्यू टॉपिक इज दी प्लांट वाटर रिलेशनशिप एक्चुअली द अर्लियर आई हैव टेकन टू मोर टॉपिक दैट इज दी ऑस्मोसिस एज वेल एज डिफरेंट मोड्स ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट विच आल्सो कम्स अंडर दी ट्रांसपोर्ट इन प्लांट्स ओके दिस इज द चैप्टर नेम सो आई हैव टेकन ऑल दोज टॉपिक इफ यू रियली वॉन्ट टू नो अबाउट दोज वन यू कैन वॉच माई दीज वीडियोज राइट okay so let's have a look of a plant water relationship see water performs so many roles in plant like pl water is the medium for the transport of the nutrients okay nutrients and various minerals they are responsible for providing or for transportation of these nutrients to the plant okay second one is the water is the medium where all the chemical reaction takes place chemical reactions takes place okay and what is the important part of the protoplast of a cell in a cell the protoplast this is the protoplast okay so water play a uh, important role in protoplast i mean or you can say this protoplasm it is completely made up of water and then this water so many organelles and other substances are embedded substances they are present inside it okay what are also responsible for the enlargement or for the growth of the plant okay so it is also responsible for the growth of the plant right because because of the when water goes inside cell get enlarged and because of this the growth of plant also occurs so these all are the role played by the water right now uh, if we want to know about the plant water relationship we should know three different important terms what are those terms so let's have a look the first term is the water potential the first term is the water potential okay second term is the solute potential right and the third term is the pressure potential right so let's have a look of though these three terms so first of all i'm taking the water potential so what do you mean by water potential see if it is in a container a water is present okay it means you can say these are the water molecule right okay and they have certain energy they have certain energy which is the kinetic energy okay the water molecule has the kinetic energy and because of this kinetic energy water molecule they move here and there means what it is movement here and there so water movement is because of this kinetic energy right okay so it means this kinetic energy is the potential of the water so this kinetic energy is actually called the water potential water potential right so i can say more the molecule of water more water potential would be there right clear okay and because of this uh, water potential the water moves from its high water potential high water potential to its low water potential okay high water potential means what here the molecules are high water molecules are high and here the water molecules are low so because of this the water moves from its high concentration to low concentration due to the kinetic energy which is actually called the water potential okay so it means if i take a pure water if i uh, ask for a pure water it means this water doesn't have any impurity any solute it is a completely pure water it means the pure water has the maximum water potential right okay maximum water potential okay so what will be the maximum water potential it means at the standard temperature standard temperature and when there is no pressure exerting from outer side when there is no pressure exerting from outer side the water potential is taken as a zero okay the water potential is taken as a zero this is the standard potential right okay 
and if i will add some solute inside this okay if i'll add some solute inside this what will happen this solute will make a reaction with this water and get bind with this okay so it means more solute it will uh, there is what will happen less free water molecule right okay because uh, so many water molecule will react with this solute so there will be less free water molecule then what will have there will be less kinetic energy there will be less water potential okay it means what if i make a solution or you can say in a pure water if i add something solute or some impurities anything anything it will become the solution as you know in water if i'll add this solute it will become the solution right okay so this solution its water potential will get decrease okay its water potential will get decrease right because of the uh, uh merging or the dissolution of the solute molecule it means when we add more and more solute in it the water potential will get decrease whatever the solutions are present they all are having less than the pure water potential okay their water potential would always be less than the pure water potential or i can say the solution solution water potential will be always in negative okay if if i'll put a zero here okay if there is a less so it will always in the negative sign so one more thing about water potential it is denoted by a sign which is called psi p s i this is the sign and the unit is called the pascal unit p a okay this is the sign denoted to water potential so i'll write it like this this is the water potential it is showing the water potential this sign is showing the potential if it is water potential then i will write small w over here this is the water potential clear okay adding the solute water potential is getting decrease so it is taken always in negative sign and what is the solid potential it is the potential which is Uh, having the capacity to decrease the water potential okay But if uh, at a certain atmospheric pressure at a small atmospheric pressure the solute potential and water potential are equal okay so first we i'll denote the solute potential by this sign okay so uh, this is the sign of solute potential or at the atmospheric pressure this water potential and the solute potential is equal there's only one difference which is what it is of negative sign okay fine it is of negative sign it means if i'm adding more solute there will be less solute potential are you getting me because if if i am adding more solute there will be a less water free water or there will be less water potential clear okay so the solid potential will also be less okay also will be less let's understand this uh, by example if i add in two container there is a water present okay and if i am adding a solute around 100 here okay here i am adding around 200 fine so what as i told you at atmospheric pressure water potential is equal to solute potential so what will be the uh, this one water potential will be 100 pascal clear but it will be of negative sign here also water potential will be 200 pascal but the sign will be negative so can you tell me which one is having more water potential this one will be having more potent potential because it is of negative sign when we go towards increasing number in a negative sign the potential will be decreasing okay so it is a more water potential it is having less water potential as well as the solute potential will also be less in this case as compared to earlier one clear okay so we look of the third one that is the pressure potential means what if i put pressure over here or pressure over here what will happen its kinetic energy will get increase and the water potential will get increase means what if pressure increase 
the water potential also get increase okay this potential is called the pressure potential and it is denoted by this sign okay psi is the sign over here and if i am talking about pressure potential i'll put p over here so it means there's a relationship between pressure potential and water potential is this one okay at atmospheric pressure they both are equal but it is of positive sign clear okay uh, okay let's understand with another thing also when in a cell what is coming inside okay when water molecule comes inside what happened these molecule put pressure over the wall okay opposite pressure generated and because of this one pressure the cell become enlarged the cell will become enlarged in size okay this is called the turgid cell this is called the turgid cell so that is why this pressure this pressure is called the turgor pressure okay turgor pressure or it is also called the pressure potential pressure potential so i hope it is clear this is actually the pressure potential so more water comes inside more pressure will be generated on the wall of the cell okay more pressure water comes inside more pressure will be generated on the wall of the cell so that is why they both are equal to each other okay so if it will increase pressure also increase or if pressure increase water potential also increase so if i put all these three terms okay in a equation so there is a complete relationship in this one what water potential is equal to solute potential plus pressure potential only the thing is different that is solute potential in, is in the negative sign so this is the complete relationship in between these three potential now what kind of question comes okay what happens sometime question like uh, they have given the solute potential as well as the pressure potential okay of two different containers suppose here the solute potential is given and pressure potential in this container also solute potential as well as pressure potential is given so they will ask you who which one is having what a higher water potential and where the water will move okay as you know in osmosis water moves from its high concentration to low concentration or you can say water moves from its high water potential to low water potential so which one is having high water potential will move towards the less water potential right so question can comes like this okay let's have a look of a one question and on that basis you will be clear about it okay see if there are two container i am putting these two okay has water is present right and some solute i have added here okay so i am putting like this this is the solute particles these are the solute particles okay this is the chamber a this is the chamber b fine so my first question is what which chamber has the more water potential i'm asking again which chamber has the more water potential so which chamber has the more water potential which one is having more solute this one if this having more solute then water potential will be lower and if having less solute the water potential will be higher so chamber a will have the more water potential okay next question is what about the solute potential that which chamber has the lower solute potential and which one having the higher solute potential so let's have a look this these are the solute and here in chamber b solute are more okay as compared to chamber a but as i told you more the solute lesser will be the solute potential okay because it decrease the water potential so solute potential will be lesser so from which chamber chamber b has the lesser solute potential it is less solute potential whereas chamber a has the higher solute potential or high solute potential because there are less solute are present so more water potential would be there so more solute potential would also be there okay next question in which direction osmosis occur 
सो कैन यू टेल मी इन विच डायरेक्शन बिकॉज ए चैम्बर हैज मोर वाटर पोटेंशियल एंड इट हैज लेस वाटर पोटेंशियल इट इज़ हाई वाटर पोटेंशियल इट इज़ लेस सो एज आई टोल्ड यू वाटर मूव फ्रॉम हाई टू लेस वाटर पोटेंशियल सो द डायरेक्शन विल बी फ्रॉम ए चैम्बर टू बी चैम्बर ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वॉट वॉट विल इफ आई विल एड इन चैम्बर ए आई विल एड अराउंड हंड्रेड पासकल वाटर पोटेंशियल सपोज ओके एंड चैम्बर बी हैज द सपोज टू हंड्रेड पासकल वाटर पोटेंशियल आई एम पुटिंग बाई माइनस साइन ओके चैम्बर ए हैज हंड्रेड थाउजेंड पासकल वाटर पोटेंशियल एंड चैम्बर बी हैज माइनस टू थाउजेंड पासकल वाटर पोटेंशियल सो विच चैम्बर हैज द मोर वाटर पोटेंशियल इन दिस केस सो नेगेटिव साइन सो ऑब्वियसली दिस विल बी दी हायर वाटर पोटेंशियल okay so like this kind of question can comes uh, on the basis of these plant water relationship so i hope this video is clear to all of you if you have any doubt you can put your queries in the comment box if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon also and yes of course share this uh, video as much as possible so thank you so much guys for watching this video thank you